What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're looking at rumors and leaks over the last seven days, starting with the UCS Razor Crest. The pricing's leaked at 599. It's 6187 pieces. Set number 75331. This comes from Promo Bricks. It is 60 centimeters long, 40 centimeters wide. The cockpit is between 8 and 10 studs wide. It should have a pretty detailed interior. There's a small stand, obviously, like all UCS uh, collector's editions. It features the minifigures of Dinjarin and Durasteel armor. And I believe he's got arm printing, so this might become like the Boba Fett that's super expensive. Just thanks to his arms. Comes with Grogo with a white pram which looks pretty good it's a unique pram as well brick built by the look by the rumors um, and the leaked images mithril and kuel kuel is riding a brick built blurg that looks like it, it, it looks like it's from, from the microfighters it should be its own little set that'd be very cool like the tauntaun with luke skywalker we would really appreciate that up next in the leak department we've got set number 76214 it's called water wars it's from black panther it features the royal sea leopard this is from brick depot we have got a description which looks like it's a leaked description from lego.com it comes with black panther by the looks of it most importantly we've got the minifigure list there's five minifigures we get mbaku bukoya Black Panther, Ironheart Mark II, and King Namor, and it's rumored to be $80. For the holiday fans, we've got 10308 Holiday Main Street. This was five days ago, this leaked. It's set number 10308, as I said. It's possibly... No, it is more expensive. We know that for a fact. It's $130, not $99, as per the original leak. The leak came from Brick Depot as well, but it comes with a tram, which looks epic in the leaked photo this is definitely the highlight of this set a few people are disappointed with the shops because they look like they're just shop frontages as opposed to fully uh, enclosed buildings which would have been really nice i get why they didn't because they got the tram but you know four minifigures we're not do i have details i don't really have the details on the minifigures um they're just people though holiday holiday style people a big leak next up we've got the updated star wars lineup i will run through it very quickly this is potential lineup you know in quotes it's still you know rumored but we've got known a star wars poly bag a may 4th promo two brick heads a slave one micro fighter the 501st battle pack which we know is coming a set based on the mandalorian season three the tie bomber another set based on mandalorian season three Captain Rex Phase 2 Helmet, the Commander Cody Phase 1 Helmet, the Death Star Throne Room slash Jedi, uh, Jedi Jabba the Hutt Throne Room Diorama, uh, yet those are interchangeable, and the Indoor Chase Diorama, and a May 4th UCS, and another exclusive helmet. In addition to this leak, we do know now that one of the dioramas is going to be based off Jabba the Hutt's throne room. We're not sure whether it's uh, the original movie trilogy or if it's going to be from Book of Boba Fett. Hopefully it's the original trilogy. These dioramas tend to work towards that, so we'll wait and see there. Weirdly, with these Star Wars leaks, we've got a potential scrapped video head which is a triceratops wearing headphones which i have to say as far as unique minifigure heads goes that's very cool i think the video uh minifigures were unique fun and really cool it's just a shame the concept didn't work overall so you know we'll never get this minifigure head unfortunately and then finally we get the ucs razor crest decent image it's not high quality but it's a good image of what it's going to look like and i'll be honest i was very skeptical i thought this was a waste of time i really really do like this now i ooh, i'm on the fence i'm on the fence i really don't know i've still got the mandalorians um to build myself the non ucs version oh, this looks very detailed it looks very good it's very pricey this is, this is going to be a close one, team. What do you think of this set? Let me know in the comments. Hit the subscribe button. 
We'll catch you in the next video. Thank you for watching.